Good morning Otis and welcome along to another edition of Adventures with Otis. And Otis has a stick already. One, two, three, catch. <laughs> and we're in the woods. The sun is peering through. We're actually just to the north of the Christchurch Cemetery. Um, yeah, we just came for a little walk this morning. Didn't intend ending up in the woods, but uh, we just came down the bank this sort of way. And uh, yeah, just to the side of the railings is the uh, the cemetery. So we've ended up for a little woodland walk again. And Oates is really off on his adventure. Come on, you! You just stay nearby. <clears throat> So that this wood is actually known as spring wood, um, mainly because it's the source of many springs running downhill um, to the River Esk from here. And uh, yeah, it's a new wood for me. It's a very steep one, I'm trying not to fall down the bank here. Once again, no sign of wildflower or anything. <clears throat> Just a wild otis. Right, well, here's the first of the springs. As you can see, it's bubbling there out of the ground. And that runs right away downstream to the River Esk. This is the source of the spring where it comes up out to the ground. Uh, I bet that water's nice there Otis, nice and fresh. Absolutely. And it descends right the way down through the valley eventually to the River Esk over towards Clean Road. Okay, you just come on. Let's carry on. Well, looks like you've got ourselves another stream to follow, Otis. So, uh, yeah, we'll just follow it through the woods and see where it goes. You never know, we might even find a spring at the head of it. Hey Otis, looks like we're getting near the uh, the end of the spring anyway, or actually the source of the spring. It looks very dry at the top end there where you are. 
but make out some residue here as the spring or the stream starts. And here we are. This is where the stream or the spring is bubbling up. Not bubbling, bubbling, but it's certainly coming out of the ground. Uh, it follows right the way downwards, just as you'd expect. And that's where we just walked up from, right the way down through the woods. Okay, Otis, right, let's carry on and um, see if we can find our way into these woods. <laughs> Going that way, or should we go this way? Otis, go this way. Come on. Good boy. on a path I've not seen before. I think she's got some houses here. Very narrow path. And I've got no idea where it goes. Where do you think it goes, Otis? <laughs> Come on, keep going. Good boy. Oh, I love new uncharted walks. Oh, wow. I believe this is bringing us out to the church. Oh, it certainly looks that way. Otis, come here. Let's put your lead on your man. Stay. <laughs> come here. Oh, Good boy. Does this gate actually work? Oh, you can fit through it. Yes, it does, just about. So there we go. And here we are. At the Holy Trinity Church at Christchurch. Phenomenal. Okay, well, we'll take a little walk around the side of it before we sign off for the morning. Well, you can see the, uh, the stained glass window here. Of course, back in Oliver Cromwell's day, the cronies stayed here, didn't they, and smashed it to bits. Smashed every single glass window, apart from an orange one, apparently. Or was it a window in the orangery? One or the other. But these look as if they've all been replaced. Oh, that one actually looks fairly original. A bit nosy. I believe we can. <laughs> Are 
You're a strange dog. You having fun? You truffle hunting. Okay. This way, little fella. Okay, well Oates and I are going to sign off for the morning. Thank you very much for joining us on this peaceful Sunday morning. Look forward to the next time. So please click on that subscribe and like button and click on the notification bell. Don't forget, please leave a comment or two. We'd love to hear from you. Isn't that right, Otis? <laughs>